what I'm talking about. Wait. Okay, now, from the beginning. Hit it, boys. Attention please, this is, we have just experienced an earthquake, we are now looking into the situation. That was pretty intense. Still, <laughs> my heart. <laughs> I still feel like it's rocking a little bit, but I don't think it is. Wow. Woo. It's a bit scary. now because I'm filming on my Sony RX100 and also it's weird because I'm not wearing makeup and that is very rare for me. The only reason I'm not wearing makeup today is because um, believe it or not this is actually the best that my skin has looked in like the past four months I think. Yeah I've been suffering 
suffering. I say suffering like it's it's a huge deal. I know my skin isn't terrible, but it's definitely not the best. I've been dealing with a lot of really bad acne for the past couple of months. I mean, you can still see I've got like, it's a bit of like scarring and a few new ones popping up, but um, yeah, so I've been on antibiotics for a couple of weeks now and using some new products, which has actually helped quite a lot. And that's where I'm off to right now. I'm going to a skin clinic here in Hiro. Now, I, I know that people will often, everyone likes to give advice and I know that they're well-meaning and they're not trying to be rude or anything like that, but giving someone advice on something that is as difficult as skin is, is really um, unhelpful because I can guarantee that anything that you say to that person, they've heard it a million times before and they've tried everything possibly that they could possibly imagine, um, which is very true for me. So. Uh, yeah, please, please don't give me any advice on my skin, trust me. I, oh my gosh, no. I guess I'm heading back to the station then. Um. <laughs> so basically with my work schedule, I don't always get a weekend. So sometimes I'm working seven days or like 14 days in a row or something like that. So I don't always have time to go out and travel. And that of course makes up the majority of my content on YouTube is my travel vlogs. So if I can't travel, then there's no travel vlogs. Which is why recently I've just been making a lot of uh, like sit down talking about general Japan things. But when I think about, when I've been thinking a lot about recently is what I am, what I really truly love and enjoy and I'm passionate about and that at the moment is um, something that's a bit more creatively fulfilling like travel vlogs. They're really difficult to do and the editing takes forever but I thoroughly enjoy doing it. Occasionally if I've got the morning off or the afternoon off I'll go and do something then so that's what I kind of wanted this video to just be like instead of one full day of travel it's like four or five half days of going out and doing something generally fun in Tokyo or Japan. I suppose this video is probably more towards my subscribers, not necessarily people that are just coming to my channel for the first time and good lord I hope this isn't the first video of mine to like yeah completely blow up on YouTube because YouTube always has a way of blowing up videos that you don't want to blow up. Just like an update I guess, just general kind of life in Japan. And these are the things that I do on my days off and well my afternoons off I guess. I hope that this video doesn't completely suck to edit, it probably will but you know things fresh. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think it's like just a sticker. Like you just put it on top. Oh wait, no. Oh, it actually changes the color. <gasps> While you're sleeping. Stop it. Oh my gosh. And you peel it off and it's a different color. That is interesting. She's so fine, Andrew. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Ah, ah, yes, I must. I'm going to play a prank on the Japanese people. You slip a little bit of ginger. You get kicked out really fast. <laughs> <laughs> it's just when you, it wouldn't even be funny. It would just be like, hey, you ate ginger. They'd be like, okay. <laughs> gotcha. You still have a green tea powder on your nose. Oh, still there. <laughs> yeah, you got it. 